Hey guys, welcome and or welcome back to the channel today. We are going to be stuffing my priority binder. I actually um, have been wanting to stuff this a little bit more, so you will be seeing this binder um, a lot more. I actually got this binder from Sparkle Color Create. Um, I will leave her link in the description down below, but I actually got two binders from her and um, I actually been thinking about going back to her to get more binders. I'll actually check her website out not too long ago, but she's actually running out of the items, so I don't know if she's going to do a restock anytime soon, but um, I did get these two binders um, from her. And this one is the dark gray color. So what I was thinking about doing is that on Freebie Fridays, I would like to stuff this one a lot more. Well, I would like to actually stuff this more than just on Freebie Fridays. So... I have $100 that I would like to to stuff and um, oh I forgot to get the tins out um, and then once I stuff that what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, go to my bills binder and stuff those so here I have this one's real all right, so the tens and the ones are real money, and the twenties are actually um, prop dollars, and I have my fifties in the back. So I have one hundred dollars that I wanted to stuff in here, but what I wanted to do was, since they are in order um, from high priority um, to least priority, I wanted to do, yeah, I wanted to do one, two, three, four. Five. yep okay so I wanted to get the 20s I have $100 that I wanted to go ahead and put in each one because if the $100 is in my Sophie account already oh, let me skip this one I told myself I was going to skip um, self-care because I wanted to hit um, the back to school and four and then five okay so what I've actually been doing lately um, is that I've actually been making envelopes I know I said I wasn't gonna make envelopes well these are actually starting to bubble up because I did not leave the little clear slip at the top um, if you know about vellum envelopes they actually or yeah, vellum. I was I thought I was saying it wrong. Um, vellum envelopes, they actually kind of like bubble up and um, it's really like annoying. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to make envelopes, envelopes. Um, they're just going to be clear envelopes. Um, and I'm not sure if I'm going to put them in the shop or not, but um, they are double sided envelopes. So if you can actually see if I can actually do it. If you actually can tell, um, it has two slits and yeah, you can see right there. Um, and I'm just going to have a challenge in the front or the dashboard in the front and then have the money stuffed in the back. Um, the reason why I'm going to separate it is because whenever I have days like today where I'm putting money in like $20, it is not going to be marked on the the little challenge that we're doing on freebie fridays but i want to stuff this more often so i'm going to be making the dashboard for um for each envelope and then i will be replacing them once i actually get the dashboards created and everything so um i will be swapping out all of my envelopes so you will be seeing um the title and everything's going to be the same it's just the um these envelopes are going to be replaced and they're going to be i think it's going to be on white paper instead of the vellum because there's no point in me wasting my vellum whenever I need it for the inserts that I actually make. So this is what I've actually been doing, but I'm not going to do it today, but I will do it with y'all whenever I do it. But that is the reason for it. I'm going to go ahead, like I did today, I will be stuffing, you know, money into these binders whenever I put money over to the side and I get money placed into my Sophie account and it's a little bit difficult for me to, um, take money out of the Sophie account um, because it's not a it's an online bank it's not a local bank so you will be seeing prop money whenever I'm stuffing whenever the money is being placed into the savings account there 
So with that being said, we are going to um, play with, I think I said $30. So I wanted to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 73 74 75 76 77 78 79 80 81 82 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 91 92 93 94 95 96 97 98 99 100 101 102 103 104 105 106 107 108 109 110 111 All right, so I'm, I'm not quite sure if I actually did my intro, but my name is Cassie J. I'm a cash budgeter. I am on a debt-free journey. I'm trying to get my life together. I'm trying to change my life in six months. So I am actually making moves, like silent moves, um, to see how I can actually change my life and get this tactical plan down or whatever. Um, I will be bringing y'all on on the journey, um, vlog-wise, and, you know, just basically just showing you what's all changed over but i am not going to tell you first and then do it i'm going to tell you once once it's been completed and it's in a you know successful way or whatever then i'll actually show you i believe in that saying where people say you know don't tell people you know don't tell people what you're doing until after it's already done because once you tell somebody that you're doing something there's something a negative input of some sort that somebody says that actually holds you back and has you thinking differently than what you actually have your mind set to so um that is the reason for a lot of my decision making even though i have strong supporters and i'm so appreciative of everything that y'all um, do and you know with YouTube and even with the people that I've met through YouTube I really do appreciate every single last one of you but there are some things that I've actually been doing on the side that I have not actually spoke to um, with anyone and then also I'm on this death free journey so um, I previously showed that um, my credit score actually went down 20 points one of my debts actually got paid off and with it being paid off my credit score went down and I don't know why exactly um so i am actually going to reach out and see if i can actually get that taken care of because that doesn't make any sense to me i want it to make sense so let's go ahead and start what i'm going to do is i'm going to flip the card um which by the way i want to show you i will be adding these to the shop i am going to show you how i plan on using them but they are cards and they are going to be low budget i don't know if i'm going to do high budget as of yet but they are going to be low budget and I'm, i plan on adding them to the shop and whenever i add them i will actually have a video of how to use them but that is something new that is actually coming to the shop as well as i have a christmas bingo that i need to knock out that's make that makes me nervous that i would like to <laughs> i would like to play all right so let's go ahead and get this started all right so 10 1 2 3 4 5 Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine. Oh, I was ready to stuff. <laughs> I'm ready to stuff and I don't even have a number. I actually have um, have been having issues with my phone lately. It's not taking my fingerprint. And then whenever I um, try to turn it on or turn it off I'm having like the worst um, problems with trying to just turn it on and turn it off it's, it's so annoying and I try to hold on to my phone until I just can't hold on to it anymore and I think I'm getting to that point my last phone I wasn't able to charge it anymore and that's the reason why I switched it out like I I know that like young younger people want to switch out their phone they want to have like the new stuff whatever and I just I'm just not that girl anymore. I don't want a new phone. It actually drives me nuts to have a new phone because whenever you get a new phone, you have to download all the apps. You have to remember the passwords. You have to remember all the logins. Like, I'm, I'm just not built for it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then I was thinking about, like, I, I'd rather keep my phone or use my work phone since this phone's down before replacing it. Like, that's how serious I'm about this. Like, I don't want to, I don't want, I do not want a new phone. And I was telling my daughter about it. She was like, you need one. And I was like, I know, but do I for real? What was that for? One, two, three, four, five, six. 
am i the only one maybe i'm just lazy i have no idea but i really honestly i do not i do not like um getting any phone I'm trying to think of what else would I, would I, how else can I like not pay for, or not pay for, but like get in the, how else can I get through this like situation of not having to get a new phone, but there's like no way, three, four, five, six, and I'm not a, um, I'm not a iPhone person, so whenever I like get another phone, it's like, it doesn't just like automatically switch over, so. I mean, I, the, the, I was told that you can actually do it. Seven, six, five. You can actually do it on Android, but you have to have everything like backed up and I'm not one to have stuff backed up too. <laughs> I'm not one to back up stuff, like what? Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I went through my, all my cards for. <laughs> that is hilarious. All right, so I'm actually kind of excited to see um, how I'm going to be able to play my game any other time. But let's go ahead and where is my? All right, so this one's going to get three. Hasn't had anything before. And let's just do two. Let's do one, one, two, three. One, two, three. You know, I was thinking all of them are going to be three because we went through all of them, right? Unless it doesn't have three on each one. But I feel like I was doing another challenge on that one. Yep, three dollars. Yep, I think it is. This one's ten each icon, and this one has one, so it has five in it. Besides the 20 I just put in there today. And then three dollars again. I should have just put three dollars in every one of them. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> Three. And this one is doing a little bit different. I'm just gonna go ahead and speed up through it because all of them are three. All right. So that was actually interesting. Went ahead and did that. And then I still have my tins. I think I have 100, 120, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110. And we're going to put 10 in each one. Oh, oh. Um, this one was getting 100. So I'm going to use my prop. Rent is getting 110. Internet is getting 10. And this is my month ahead envelope, I mean binder. It is how I'm trying to get um, a month ahead and trying to like stay focused on 
you know everything that I'm actually doing because lately I've realized that I'm I'm really distracted um, I'm trying to I'm trying to take care of um, and three and a miscellaneous I'm, tr I'm, tr um, I'm trying to not spend but me not me trying to not spend I'm also not paying things because I don't want to spend the money and it's weird because I'm like usually if something pop comes up and I'm like oh okay this is due I just pay it like I don't you know whatever and then with me trying to be debt free or whatever if it's like a debt related something I like just pay it and get out the way but lately I just wanted to like I just want to like hold on to it like I'm clinging on to this money for I have no idea why and it's it I, I don't I don't understand it so I did want to say I did want to say that I had some money in here that I needed to get out and I think it's like $20 yeah $20 and then also while I have this out, let's go ahead and put this here. Um, I will be keeping these envelopes. I was gonna do like a whole different video, but it is like really late at night and I'm trying to merge videos so I can have some out because I have a whole list of things that I wanna do for next week. Um, so the in my wallet, I'm actually just gonna keep like three or four. I'm gonna keep gas because I would like to always have cash in case I forget a debit card or a debit card is not working, I would always like to have cash. I want to take cash to work. I do not want to swipe my debit card uh, so that I can actually leave my debit cards at home. And I'm gonna do dine out because I have days where I have day dates with my coworkers or you know with the kids and I try to make sure that I'm trying to be realistic. I'm not going out to eat as much but I am, I am trying to be realistic. So I'm going to keep this envelope in my, um, in my wallet. And then, um, for miscellaneous, I want to have this one as a backup because sometimes I'm just like, oh, I need to go to Dollar Tree and I go get something from the, like the store or whatever. And it's not necessarily household stuff. It's just like miscellaneous. And so these envelopes here are going to go into my low priority. So the business, um, I the my business envelope I buy everything online like on Amazon or Uline or whatever for my business I don't buy any I don't go to Hobby Lobby anymore the way I used to so I'm gonna go ahead and keep that into the, the low priority groceries again online um, I do groceries at Walmart and at HEB the same day and so um, I do it curbside because I don't want to go into the store now meat, however, we do buy meat once a month and we do go to, I do give my money, um, my mom the money so that she can go to like the, um, the meat market or something like that to get like the good meat or whatever. So I do have that, but this envelope, as you can tell, is the reason why I am going to be getting rid of the vellum envelopes and, um, laminating it and everything is just, it, it's just not working. So that's why I'm getting rid of these vellum envelopes, or whatever, so that I can go to the, double envelope and just have the um things stuck in there so i've already made um a good 10 to 20 um of the double envelope already so you'll you'll be seeing those binder setups later and i also want to order two more binders um so that whenever i do the updates the uh, it'll be updates for these binders as well so i think it, i think i'm gonna get white i'm not sure yet but um so the groceries i'm, get, I'm gonna have cash here at the house so that I can give it to my mom household I'm going to try to bulk it up to like a hundred and then go buy stuff instead of just buying stuff on a whim and then my um, son is the only one that I've been spending money on and he's very lenient he doesn't really need anything he's not a needy kid so every time he goes somewhere he can go to a store and not want anything y'all ask him hey do you want something real quick do you want a toy do you want a game do you want you know whatever he's like no nah. Let's just save the money. And I'm just like, all right, cool. You know, so I'm not going to force you. Um, so let me go ahead and pull up the. All right. So we have this. And 
there are these in the back. And I have of like four or five clear binders that actually hold all of my envelopes. I only stuff the ones that are coming up current. And so I was going to do high and low, but I just went ahead and decided to just stick to the high binder, uh, my month ahead, my service challenges, month ahead, and my high priority, my wallet, and then my mini Mondays. These two, however, I added them because I think I'm going to be doing something. So I have a Christmas binder that I would actually like for it to be red. These are just envelopes that I had got on um, online and I'm not sure how I feel about them. They are, they're rubbery. They're, they're like a, um, they're like the uh, zip material, the zip envelopes on the front. And in the back, they are clear. They are clear in the back. And so they're just not stretchy, you know? So whenever I'm putting things in it, it's kind of like I have to like, you know, to put it in. And I don't really like that too much. So I am trying to figure out what I'm going to do with these envelopes. But I do have a Christmas binder that is coming up. And I have a travel binder that is coming up um, because I'm actually making it myself. Um, so that is something that I will let y'all know whenever I get that out. But right now, this one is one that I found. Um, and it was the save $1,000. Um, dollars, but the amounts are kind of steep. So I think what I'm going to do is whenever I have like some leftover money, I'm going to leave this on the counter. Um, and this is going to go to my emergency fund. And whenever I have like a dollar or two, I'm just going to stuff it in here. And then whenever it's completed, like if I get to the 80 and if it's completed, I'm just going to put it in the back and then just, you know, just move them that way so that I can still stuff it. But I don't know, not get, not get discouraged because I get discouraged very easily because I'm like, oh, I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> so, okay. So the next thing I said I wanted to do, we unstuffed the wallet. We went over these two binders. We went over the high priority and Christmas bingo. I said, mm. we already did the, and we already did a month ahead okay so let's go ahead and do Christmas bingo okay so first thing I want to do is I want to stuff the four dollars that I owed from the last time and go ahead and remove everything out of here this is something that I just added into the shop um, it comes with a savings challenge a, da a small additional bonus savings challenge and a dashboard and I'm not doing the bonus challenge as of yet but I am playing the game so I already hit one I already hit $50 so I went ahead and put this in my um, high yield savings whatever and made sure that I put a prop to replace it because it was $53 that we had in here before and then we're gonna add the four oh but we are going to take five and take a five. So we have the 57. Because, honey. Then I believe they are in the back. So we had B1, O1. N1 and D1. Okay. So these are the ones that I've already used. And I'm just putting a mark on the back of them so that in the future I already know which one they are. This is a um, a dry erase uh, marker. So these should, oh, well, I shouldn't have did that, but <laughs> these are um, the dry erase. So all you got to do is like have a little um, cloth thing and and take it off all right so let's go ahead and move this because i did a uh did that with the sharpie so we'll have to scrub that one out because i didn't have the markers at the time right, and then oh, i'll go ahead and link these markers that i'm using in the description 
Um, I was going to get the Visa V, but they're expensive and I'm cheap. So I did not want to spend a whole bunch of money on something that I'm probably just going to be using. You know, I guess I would use it more than once, but I don't, I didn't want to get the expensive ones. All right. So the first one we're going to do, let's go ahead and say, if I win a bingo, okay, then I am going to, um, if I win a bingo, I'm going to start over. Let's put that there. And then it's going to be um, $10 to my ten dollars to my self-care. And I will put a prop dollar for my self-care to remind me that I need $10, uh, the $10 if I, if I use all the real, the real cash. And the real cash, I have five ones. I was going to put it down, but never mind. And a one five. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. So 65, 70, $70. All right. Let's see how this goes, guys. Let's see how this goes. Ooh, I'm nervous already. In three, yes. For, girl, you starting off right, yeah. Yes, let's go ahead and just leave you over. Oh, four. Let's do this. So I said 70. Let's do it over here. Two, three, four, minus three. I five, minus eight. O five, minus four. Woo, seven dollars. Got. Dang it. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Okay. How much do I have left? 48. Oh. <laughs> Why? I forgot about them. I was going and I was like, oh, you know, I'm getting these numbers. <laughs> Playing it amazingly. And then a seven hit me. Oh, shoot. Okay. B4. Oh, another seven. Oh, God. Okay. Ooh, it got hot. Oh, it got hot, guys. I don't even want to hold nothing. Okay. B5, $3. Oh, shoot. I won. I thought that was $11. I was about to pass out. <laughs> oh, look at this. We need a seven. Wait, what did I just... I won six. Oh. We need a seven. We need... Oh, we, we have $32. We might get a bingo. Okay, okay. Who $10. D3, D3, D3. $9. God dang it. Bro. Yo, we need a G, but we didn't need no three, okay? I three. Oh, six dollars. Wait, is there another bingo coming? Up? Oh, hold on, wait. I just got really excited. Hold on, wait. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't think I can do this. I am not old enough. Ah, four. Whoa. I'll take the three. I'll take two. I'll take the two. I'll wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I three. I. Three, six, okay. And then I four, I, I four is four dollars. Okay, girl, got excited. Okay, so we need a G two. Okay, we need a G two. And then, and then, sorry, let me kind of. Hopefully, we don't get the G the, the G one because that one's seven dollars. Well, I mean, we got thirteen dollars, so we we can afford it. Or uh, I two, okay. Or oh, I two. Ah. <laughs> Ten dollars. <sighs> Please give me the I two. I two. I two. G four. <sighs> One dollar. Okay. Oh. 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 We still. Do, we'll get. We'll, we will get two bingos if we get the I two. Right. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we only got two dollars. <laughs> we gonna have. Oh. Oh, what do you think it is going to be, guys? What do y'all think? Should I stop? Should I go? We got $2. We got $2. Oh, man. What should we do? What should we do? Oh, God. Please tell me. Answer me. I just want to text somebody and ask them if I should do it more. Because there's a possibility of me not being able to. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. We got another I, I O U. Okay, dang, now it, it could be a, this one because if it's this one, it's not gonna be a bingo. Look how close! Oh man, this is why I can't play. 
I'd, I'd owe a dollar and I, I'd be I'd be happy with owing a dollar. Oh, okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. What? <sighs> three. Three dollars. We owe three dollars. Dang. Dang, I'm so close. Dang. Oh man, we need a G. What was the next card? Y'all know we gotta do O2. Oh, the next card wouldn't even put me on there. Oh no. Dang. Oh, let me put this back. Not the mark all. I gotta put this one back. The 10 back. No, I'm dang it well. We don't need the 10 back in now. The 7 back. Ooh. All right, let's go ahead and mark these. So, so sad. I'm probably gonna get a paper clip or something instead of having to mark them. Cause I was thinking like if I'm marking all of them, then whenever it comes to cleaning it, I have to clean each and every one of them. And that just didn't sound like something I want to do. So, oh, now I'm throwing them everywhere. Mm, 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 mm. I am so sad. I'm so sad. Dog, I was so close. I had three possibles. This is why I can't go to the, I can't go to the bar. Not the bar. Let's see, look, now I'm trying to drink. <laughs> This game that made me think of alcohol. I need to go get me a drink. <laughs> oh man. All right. So we had 70, 10, 20, 30, 40, 55, 56, 50. Wait. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70. Damn. Y'all, I'd be, I'd be so devastated. So we have 57 plus 70 that was added. 73. Let me put this in the front. Oh. Ooh. All right, y'all. The link, is, link for this bingo is in the description down below. Let me go ahead and put $10. I'll put winner. Win. Self-care. All right, so... This is just how you play. If you saw how I was actually playing, this is B1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And that's how you would actually play the bingo. But if y'all are actually interested, the link is in the description down below. If y'all are playing this, please tag me because I want to see how y'all play. I already have a couple people that have um, purchased it and I'm actually waiting for them to play because I want to see how they are reacting because y'all, this is like nerve-wracking to actually watch somebody play this and you're like about to play and you're running out of money and you're just like there's nothing else i can do so i have a um i owe myself card that i had to go ahead and and do so i'm really kind of sad about that but we, we we did do a lot today um i'm gonna have to try to it's like 40 minutes in so i'm gonna have to try and you know get it down a lot lower or whatever but thank you so much for joining me y'all stay blessed stay beautiful and stay safe I appreciate y'all being here with me. I feel like it's a late night and honey, I'm about to go to bed. So y'all have an awesome day. Um, y'all stay beautiful, stay blessed, and stay safe. Bye.